Hello and welcome back to a brand new video. I am your lovely and awesome host, Buku Satsu, and here today we're going to review about the SA figure Kamen Rider Live Bat Genome. I bought this guy on Amazon on Prime Day because I found him for a really good deal on there and about I took it. I said multiple times that I'm not gonna go buy a Daiji figure because well I have evil. Yeah, while I do like live suit, never hate it to be honest. While I do like live suit, I said that I'm gonna stick with evil. I'm gonna stick with evil to represent well both Daiji and Calculator, but I said I said yeah, no fuck that. So I bought so I bought a golden bat boy right here. So, live, what are my thoughts on the figure? Is he good? Is he bad? Is he atrocious? Is he mediocre? He's good. He's not perfect? No, but he's good. All right. So let's begin with this. This is how far his, uh, this is how far his arms go. I think annoying, though, because Evil's figure wasn't like that. His Evil's figure right here. This, this, this is how far evil figure arms can go. It's a little bit better than lies, but uh, hey. I know that uh, they were trying to be fair based off the design because of, because these solar pads are on the official design as well, but uh, I felt like these are too bulky and uh, if they weren't, they would probably make the arms go up way bigger, but fortunately they can't. This this is how uh, far they can go. And you don't want to pop these off because my God, you had, you had no idea how many figures I have at the shoulder piece pop off. Cross Dragon, Domo Taros, Double Extreme, so many, so many figures. It's honestly annoying. How can his articulation? Well, this is this this is how far he go from here. To here, so it's good. He, he's like, he's good. But at the same time, there are things, there are things about him that make him a little bit more better than evil. But at the same time, there are things that make evil figure a lot. I'll say a lot more better than lives. Oh, oh yeah, one, of, one of them is this piece. Yeah, no, I did because his, his two slice, two slice driver love to pop off a lot. You gotta be very gentle with how you pop it back in. So how good does he pose? Well, he poses pretty well, actually. His neck is, this is how far his neck goes, by the way. If you have like an SA upgrade pack, I guarantee you that you can make that neck go way farther. Okay, wonderful. And, uh, damn it. Why do you not want to stay on there? This is, this is how far his, uh, this is how much you can do for posing. But, uh, you'll see all the poses I do with him in the pictures. So, it's also that too. But, uh, how good are his legs? Pretty good. How are the rubber? Oh, motherfucker. This bout does not want to stay in. Ay, ay. God fucking damn it, motherfucker. Why do you not want to stay in? I hate that fucking thing so much. Let's move this out of the way for now, anyway. How's the figure itself? Well... His, his scarf is not that, his, his, uh, scarf. His skirt is pretty good. Although, my copy, due to the freaking belt, there are smudges. I don't know if you can see that, but, uh, yeah. But, yeah, there are smudges on my force. I didn't notice that till now. Well, okay, I'm not surprised due to the fact that not every copy is gonna be normal. Hell, there are, there are copies of, there are copies of live other that are completely broken. And I want to say I feel sorry for those that uh, 
I felt sorry for those that uh well dealt with that dealt with that. But uh yeah, he said yeah, his, yeah, his legs are pretty good. So my, my only issue with him is uh these pads being too bulky. I wish they weren't, but that's just that's just me. His two slice driver won't won't stand in won't stand in until I had to pop it back in at times. And yeah, he stand yeah, he posed pretty well too. So on to his accessories. Oh, Oh yeah, we love our accessories for our figures. Oh boy! So the first one we have, we have uh, oh. for the first oh, hold on. Sorry, for the first one we have evils. We have uh evils, broken helmet that you can, that you can use, but you can only use this we if you have the evil essays figure art. I have it. Don't worry. I took a picture with this on him. You'll you'll see in the picture when we get to that part of the video. God, dude, these things are so small. He comes with the Kong Vice stamp. You know the Vice stamp that turned the Vice stamp that turned E King Vice into Forze. Oh boy, he comes with a lot of fucking accessories. My god. Here we have his here we have his open grab hands. Here we have his relax hands right here. Here we have his uh, grab hands, you can say, for the, well, for the vice stamp. And here, and here are his weapon hands to hold his gun. Oh yeah, by the way, he had the pieces for Jackal. Only to like, only to like, well, two pictures with, with this set, it's pretty good. I will say, if you want to, if you want to keep him in jackal form, you gotta be very careful with how to, with how to take the pieces off. Because I felt like while taking mine off, I, I I felt like I almost broke something and I didn't. So that's good to hear. So now move alongside, move alongside from that. Let's go on to size comparison because, yeah, we have a lot. We have a lot to compare them with. New stuff and old and old stuff. So for new. So, me for old. Here he is with, with demons. Here he is with Aguilera. He stands pretty well with both of them. And uh, this is this is so accurate though to to look, it's the bluebirds it's the blue birds uh group. Whatever that wherever uh, Daiji in here with new corporations call. Here, here's Daiji with his other half. Emo Lord. Emo Lord. Hold on, let me fix his feet. Emo Lord, okay. And here he is with a Senkoku Seiho Kamen Rider Kruger Rising Dragon. And yes, I will do a review on this guy because, oh boy, I cannot wait for you guys to see my pictures and my own thoughts on Kruger. This, this guy's really good. I cannot wait to make a video of him eventually. Here he is with his brother, Iki. And technically his other brother, Vice. He stands so well with them. The primary and secondary. Heck yeah. Here he is with Kamarai Tycoon. And here he is with Kamarai the Buffer. If you don't want to know, the next video is going to be out. If the next video I'll probably do tomorrow is uh, Tycoons. But uh, yeah, 
but yeah, he's standing pair. He's standing pair with both of them, and I love the fact that a tycoon uh, is a little bit more taller than life. Well, to be fair, the suit actor for Tycoon is a really tall guy. Oh, well, he's kind of in the middle. He's short and tall, but hey, you get what I mean. But uh, yeah, that's it, guys. Thank y'all for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, follow all my social media in the description, and uh, follow my Twitch, Twitch.tr.bookasatsu15. I do live streams. Damn it. I do live stream to Monday and Wednesday, 6 o'clock p.m. Eastern Standard Time. And I'll, prob and I'll probably be live streaming, I don't know, any random game I can think of. And uh, yeah, yeah, guys, thank you for, thank you for watching. For all my social description, like I said, and my Twitch. And uh, yeah, guys, thank you for watching. <laughs> all I said to them, but uh, my name's Aaron. I'm out, enjoy the videos, meet the pictures. Peace.